wouldn't mention myself in the same breath as God or something, you know. Yeah. It's a prop for my phone. Yeah, this is where I've written a lot of the last album, just right there on that couch. Of course, there were like bottles everywhere. I play Spin the Bottle by myself. If only there were more pure souls like ourselves. So what people to me? God only knows. I am a little paranoid about being famous. It's my very best song. My very best song. Those younger bands, what you guys have both lasted, you know, you still the test time a little bit. What's some of the advice you'd give? Keep taking the medication yeah. and uh don't take yourself too seriously. Hi, I'm Pete from Rolling Stone. I'm here with Taylor Swift at the VMA Red Cup. How are you? I'm doing awesome. How are you doing? Sure went to college, huh? Do you want to give us some details about what you were doing at a young age? You shouldn't have been. I was giving blowjobs. <laughs> It's nice to be in the building of CBGB's, and I hate it that it's not still CBGB's. In fact, they tell $300, $300 fucking t-shirts in this place. The Ramones never bought a $300 car. Go. When the time is right, I'll leave this place tonight. What's my motherfucking name? Rock and roll is here to stay. You kind of look like a beetle, and then that was it. I'm Pharrell, I'm chilling with Pete. Is, is the front lounge uh, masturbation session. Well, but in your life you have, you know, you have to take chances where you say, you know, I'm gonna do this and I don't know if it's gonna work. Tell me about your outfit. It's very gay. <laughs> I get inspired in a certain kind of combination of inspiration and jealousy. <laughs> you know, like, sorry I did put the hurt on your dog. <laughs> wow. <laughs> We have a hula hoop and that kind of like that. You lie. We're finished the interview. This is like a post bumper thing that we're shooting. <laughs>